Well, I'm back at the field. It's a windy day. You could probably pick it up <laughs> in this video right now, but uh, just rock flipping down these two hills and uh, let's see what we can find. So I just found a juvenile king snake. Sorry about the wind, guys. Uh, it's windy, so I'm gonna try to speak as loud as I can. But I just flipped over this board right here, and I found this beauty. Now this possibly could be the same one I found. Uh, here, let me get a picture of his head. This could possibly be the same one I found a couple weeks ago. I released a video on it. But um, yeah, uh, he's hiding <laughs> in my shadow. Uh, yeah, guys, these are these are truly a California gym, and I'm blessed to find three in a year. I've all, I've only had years where I haven't haven't found any, or just one, but still cool. I'm gonna let them go back, but very soft. I love baby snakes because their their skin is just so soft. So uh, let, 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 no, I put him right where he can get to it. All right, there we go. There he goes away. Beautiful snake. Let's see what else I can find. Well, let's see if I can find him. Tipped over this rock and there he is. There he is. Tree frog. Sierran tree frog. Ah, oh, I've already shown these guys, so no need to uh, get a better view of him. But I have in my hand a little western toad. Ah, oh, sorry guys. The wind. Sorry. Um, that's how small he is. Remember those tadpoles I was showing you guys? Uh, that's what these guys turn into little baby western toads and you see it's really confusing to identify them down south because they have the red spotted toad with as the name implies it's red spots and if oh, sorry guys as you oh, oh, as you can see I don't know if the camera will pick it up nope. but there are red spots on this little guy I'm gonna let him go get some pictures and uh see what else I can find of course the wind picks up right I start filming but I'm walking right here and I see something move and voila it is a beautiful mountain garter snake guys let's put him closer right here so you can observe him and the camera won't be out of focus now this guy's pretty riled up and he's musked on me but that's typical garter snake tactic I'd rather have musk than pee these are pretty common, but two snakes in one day, heck yeah, I'd take that any day. Uh, just happens to be a garter and a king snake again, but uh, heck yeah, let's let them go, because I've explained a lot about these guys already. So, uh, there you go. Wow, look at how fast they move. It's so beautiful. All right, let's see what else I can find. Another tree frog, guys. Not going to spend too much time filming them, but nice colors. All right, let's see what else. So if I have enough room in my video, I'll put this in, but uh, this, this looks worse than it seems. It's just a minor cut, but when I was putting a rock back, uh, it cut me, and uh, I just wanted to say, uh, be careful out there, guys, when uh, you're herping, because rocks can just fall like it did on me and uh, cut. It kind of stings, but uh, luckily I got antibacterial wipes, and I'm, not, I'm done for the day, so it won't get a secondary infection, and it'll heal in a week or two time. But uh, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I uh, hope you all enjoy, and uh, we'll see you on the next video.